The first thing we need to do is weigh out approximately 0.15 grams of P-aminophenol and transfer to a five milliliter conical vial. The mass of P-aminophenol that we will be using is 0.1515 grams. We've transferred our P-aminophenol to our five milliliter conical vial. We're next going to add 450 microliters of deionized water and 165 microliters of acetic anhydride to the P-aminophenol in our five milliliter conical vial. We will also add a spin vein to our conical vial. We have attached a water-cooled condenser to our five mil conical vial with our reaction mixture. We will now heat the reaction mixture with an aluminum block at about 120 degrees Celsius and stir gently. After the solid has dissolved, we will heat the mixture for an additional 20 minutes to complete the reaction. Our reaction mixture has now heated for an additional 20 minutes after the solid had dissolved. So we will now remove the vial from the heat. After the vial has cooled to the touch, we're going to detach it from our water-cooled condenser. And we're going to remove the spin vane with forceps and rinse the spin vein with several drops of warm deionized water back into the conical vial. We'll then place our conical vial in a 50 milliliter beaker and allow it to cool to room temperature. Once the vial has cooled to room temperature, we will place the vial for about 10 minutes in an ice water bath to complete crystallization. After crystallization has completed, we will collect our crystals by vacuum filtration on a Hirsch funnel. We first need to moisten our filter paper with a few drops of ice cold deionized water. We will also use the ice cold deionized water to aid us in the transfer of our crystals to the Hirsch funnel and to wash our crystals. We will then allow air to be drawn through our crystals for an additional five to 10 minutes to aid in the drying of the crystals. While our crude acetaminophen crystals continue to air dry, we need to pre-weigh a watch glass. The mass of our pre-weighed watch glass is 35.3580 grams. We now need to collect our crude acetaminophen crystals on our pre-weighed watch glass. This is what our crude acetaminophen crystals look like. We next need to determine the mass of our crude product. The mass of our pre-weighed watch glass and our crude acetaminophen product is 35.5162 grams.